all right get this last one in and done I love it on here ah, oh look at that camera bloody nice yep think it's a oh hello oh well welcome this is our new stage and uh, this is WNKR 99.5 wanker radio or channel 69 on your satellite dish WNKR wanker we pull it all together for you we're going to be doing it here live on this stage Stains is going to be here to bring you all sorts of lovely stuff so stay tuned to us WNKR 99.5 on the radio and channel 69 on your satellite dish or cable I hope you'll tune in we'll have lots of good stuff for you and uh, we'll be doing all sorts of stuff well you know you got to stay tuned or you won't hear nothing will you all right, cheerio. I'll see you later. I'm just going to go off on the other side and uh, see to our new secretary. Bye. Coming into the airport right now, the heliport, so we've got to go. Right now. Yeah. Hey, you're always buggering with me while I'm driving. I hope I'm not buggering you while you're driving. Yeah, right. You know where to go, don't you? The airport. No, we're not going to the airport, are we? We're going to no, that we're going heliport. We're going to the heliport. Right, yeah. yeah. You know, you're really stressed out about this, aren't you? What, the driving? No. No, these bloody Germans coming in. Yeah. Well, I mean, I'm beginning to have my doubts. Look. Look, someone reckon... It's going to be all right. Look. Put both hands on the wheel. No, I'm, I can steer with my knees, see? Look. No, no, I don't... I'm... <laughs> all right. darling yeah 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 bend over again yeah very nice yeah I like that oh uh, I'm sorry my name's Stainsy welcome to the evening news uh, sorry about that um, today on WNKR 99.5 we are pleased to announce the arrival of our two new DJs DJ Paul Schimbach and DJ Vili Kong so thank you, this is our last song for tonight on the WNKR 99.5 Push and Pull. Billy come here, we'll be listening to Lily Marlene. Please enjoy, we we'll see you again next Friday night. Enjoy. Yeah, so while they're listening to that, I think I will listen to some Deutsche, German music. of the Skinback here on Vanka 99.5 coming at you on a Saturday night for two hours of a little gristle and grind. It's my new show. I arrived from Germany last week. I am very, very economical with my words and my humor. And the song you will hear next will be Selena Gomez with I Love You Like a Love Song, Baby. It's been said and done, every beauty. And so this morning we're going to have light rain and clouds continuing on until the afternoon. And then, of course, by evening it's going to drop down to freezing conditions. That ends the weather on WNKR 99.5. Please stay tuned later for Paul Skinbach. And later on, on Fridays, you'll be able to listen to Willy Kong. 
So this is Sanger signing off on WNKR 99.5. Good day. Oi, Stainsy, why the bloody hell are we having to do all this stuff in a closet now while these bleeding Germans come in and they get all the new stations, all the lovely equipment, nice sets, good, I, you know, this ain't working for me, mate. It just ain't working. I'm, I'm out of here. I ain't doing this no more. Bleeding bloody. Who won the war anyway? Getting out of here. How about it? I used to have a really good job here, you know. I worked sound engineer for this Sangers and Stainsy or Stainsy and Sangers like, you know. Should be their bloody sound engineer and bloody good I was at it, right? I was, right. And them bastards, them bastards are giving my job to bloody Germans. Yeah, bloody Germans coming over and stealing my bloody job. And me, a Yorkshireman in Alabama, and I've been getting kicked out of my bloody job for a Bloody German! A bloody man! Right, off down pub to get drunk then. See thee later. I'm with that bloody singers, you know. I, I come down from here. These German DJs come in. I was the lighting engineer. I, I know, you see, I've been doing everything to help with the lighting in this show. And these Germans came in. And that uh, Sangers tells me we're out now, and we have nothing to do with it. I can't believe it, because we've been doing a lot of work here, and now we're gone. I'm going to get with Sangers, we're going to get even with them. I didn't come down on top of bus for nothing. We're going to get even with them, we are. Yes. Yes. Hello. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, something's falling off. It's like she's driving, mate. I but think somebody's been following us. Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll be honest with you, mate. This ain't working out with these, with these two Germans. What are you telling me? Have you seen how much money we've lost? Well, it's not just the money, it's the ratings, and we're getting emails and letters and phone calls every day because these dickheads aren't what they supposed to be. We lost five commercial advertisers just last night. Well, you've got Paul Skinback, who, who was, you know, supposed to be this Euro DJ hip and trendy, and he's like, he's as much fun as a plank of wood. Billy comes still in the Second World War. I swear to God, he's a closet nut. And that tank he's driving, he oh. wiped out four cars in the last three weeks. I know, I keep getting phone calls from the locals about his tank being parked everywhere and he's not giving a toss who he, whose car he runs over to get out of the parking space. You know, and if he gets pulled over by the law, he threatens them with a, with a machine gun or the... <laughs> what was that? That's my phone, mate. It's, and he won't stop calling you, will he? No, he's a pain in the arse. I, well, I call him my little suppository. Well. I've got another name for him, but I won't say it now. No, I we don't gotta, know. We've got to do something about it. You look, you, you're from East London. You, you're bound to know some mates well, that can come around and take care of I know, I know a few people. I'm from South Croyd, and all of my mates, they all got curry restaurants. Yeah, they're all palace supporters, so they won't do. I tell oh, you, and don't get <laughs> on about them again, you know. <laughs> no, I'll tell you what we, we did the best we tell could. What, i tell you what we do, all right? Yeah. Because if we try and buy them out of their contracts, it's going to cost us too much money. So I think what we should do is cut cut our losses and whatever money we can raise we'll offer that as a as a fee for for knocking these two buggers off i tell you what we'll do as well we'll take out insurance on them we'll take out insurance on them so that i know just who can give us the insurance too all right okay good i'll sort that one out then because well, we my wife's in the business peace you can't insure them and then knock them off too Somebody's been following us, I'm telling you. Don't worry about it. Yeah. Yes, mate. I understand that you uh, need a job done. Of course. It's what we're here for. We can do that sort of thing. You just gotta understand. Costs money. You got money? Because if you got money, I can do it. No problem. Anyway, you keep it hushed and I'll do the job. Right. Good on you.
Here, geezer. You know that job you wanted done? Yeah, well it's sorted, all right? Just wanted you to know. No, 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 I don't know any Yorkshiremen. Not at all. Me? Oh, come on, mate, I'm from East London. What would I admit to knowing a, a Yorkshireman for? Anyway, just wanted to let you know, the job is done. Take it easy, my man.